Hey folks, in today's video tutorial I'm going to show you how to work with section in with Creo View. If you jump directly into section tab, you can see here that it's possible to view section and system will automatically show the section through the some surface. We can say like this and you can see that right now the system make a cap sectioning. What does it mean? If I will untick this button you can see that right now the geometry is possible to see inside if I will cap the surfaces will be closed yes again here activated and deactivated yeah the first question is how to move this datum plane so you can simply select this datum plane what was automatically created and you can move with the dragger again we will hit the control button and you can better to understand where the system will move the plane and again you can rotate yeah so if I will select the arrow yeah here you can see that I can directly rotate or spin the section and again then later you can move so it's up to you how you need to specify the orientation and what you would like to see in your section. If you would like to switch the sectioning, it's good to select the present section and for example Z axis or Y axis and again you can specify the placement yeah, and move it a little bit up and down or again you can spin based on the dragger or Y axis and again you can specify the the movement. You can specify your custom setup for the section if you hit this small arrow as the properties the system will open section properties you can set by references yes yeah, so you can select the reference plane for example and come from OK and the system will show you can simply flip the visualization of the section or you can specify your custom value and change as you need. Yeah, so you will specify the in the millimeter and the system will automatically show you and dynamically change the visualization. Okay, so if you would like to finish the sectioning, you can delete section and the system will open or show you the full visualization of your assembly. Now in this quick video tutorial you have seen how it's possible to work with sectioning and how to edit preferences for the sections. Thank you and stay tuned. Bye bye. Vladimir.